welcome back to another vlog of doing art assignments at home. This week in drawing class, we actually had to read some stories or narratives and build a drawing around it, either in getting inspired from it or just completely recreating whatever we read. So I went in with a narrative and basically I read about this person who read to improve themselves. And so I went with my pens and markers and did my work. In the narrative, the writer was basically explaining how when they read something, they were completely engrossed in their reading and they did not care about the world around them and in fact, they were in a different world altogether. So I went ahead and with my colorful markers, I tried to show these squiggly lines as some sort of magical, whimsical things coming out of the book and really just penetrating into the body of the person I was drawing. Today is this painting's submission and I've submitted mine just like a couple of hours ago and now just have to wait for the class discussion to begin and see what is good about this and what can be improved so yeah this is the finished complete piece for this week's painting assignment we had to make a portrait from life and so i began with doing 10 minute sketches of the person i wanted to paint some of these sketches were from a photograph and some of them were from life. So I just finished making the basic sketch of my portrait assignment for painting class and the next step would be to take color pencils and preferably blues and greens and reds to mark out the shadows of the painting and then I will go with my acrylic paints do the first layer and then going to finish it off with oil paints to like make the painting complete and then later that day, I spent some time doing my assignment for my art history class, which was basically a drawing assignment. And so I spent some time doing that. Well, I just quickly borrowed my dad for about 20 to 25 minutes and with the help of color pencils, I marked all of the colors I needed, the lights and the darks. So this is like a reference and an underpainting all in one. So what I'm going to do now, the plan is that I am going to paint using this as my reference. Like I'm going to paint on my reference and I'm trying this out for the first time. So I don't know how this will end up, but this is like one way of painting from life because I can't have my dad sitting for me for hours straight and this is like a smarter way of doing it in my opinion so let's just see how this goes
So this is today's progress. Um, I don't know why my phone just keeps telling me that I'm running out of storage even though I'm deleting stuff. So I have to do something about that. But this is the progress for today. For my art history assignment, I wanted to use poster paints because I'm using oils a lot and I wanted a change of medium. And so I went with poster colors and sort of painted them in a digital style kind of way. That's it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, take care.